Hi, my name is Nikki Yetke, and I'm a master's student in the Subaleski Lab at the University of Florida. This poster illustrates an overview of the research I am pursuing on the ecological role of American alligator burrows in a system of isolated wetlands. I am primarily interested in how these burrows are used by animals, the microhabitat burrows provide, and how this changes with burrow location within and across wetlands. Many people may be familiar with American alligators role as ecosystem engineers in larger systems such as the Everglades where they have been documented digging deep holes which provide water and habitat to numerous species during dry periods. However, very few are familiar with the role of alligator burrows, which are tunnels in and around wetlands that may extend as deep as the water table and open up into a large turnaround chamber. Thus far, we have documented five vertebrate species utilizing these burrows, including juvenile and adult alligators, snakes, turtles, frogs, and birds. To better understand the role of these burrows, I plan to locate and quantify burrows at the Jones Center at Itchway, characterize the burrow microhabitat by temperature, humidity, and vegetation, quantify commensal species use, and quantify alligator use and movement between burrows. I anticipate that cypress gum swamps will be the most likely wetland vegetation type to contain alligator burrows due to their long hydro period. But in wetlands with short hydro periods that have burrows, we will likely find multiple burrows at varying elevations due to fluctuations in water levels over time. I also anticipate that burrows will provide a distinct microhabitat with more stable temperature and humidity than areas outside the burrow, commensal species use will be highest during dry periods, and burrow location will facilitate alligator movement between wetlands, particularly for juveniles and during mating and breeding seasons.